I'm asked often about the lesser known or less discoverable features in our search system. The biggest one that we have isn't really a search feature. It actually is in the data. Many people know that FamilySearch has billions of records available. They delight in putting in the name of an ancestor and getting back documents from that ancestor's life. It's like we opened a little window and shined a spotlight on the ancestor's life and it warms their heart. Those billions of indexed records that are searchable only represent about 30% of the data at FamilySearch.org. The other 70% of the documents that are on our website and that are about their ancestors aren't searchable. But we've made it available in multiple ways around the website. If you go to the main historical records search page, go to the map, go down below the search form and look for the lists of images, click one and you can browse through the images that way. Or go to the all published collections, find a collection that you're interested in, the browse images one, and again you will have access to drill down into the images that way. Don't be afraid of it. It is a little more work because it's not searchable. But those are two different ways to get to those images.